Well, hello there, YouTube. Long time no see. Actually, I've been kind of doing videos regularly here. Yeah, it's another Riker. But there's something special about this Riker. This is a 600 twin. It's our first crate of 600s. Let's, uh, let's not do a walk around here because I'll probably get ran over. Let's take it for a rip. <laughs> so I've gone just a little bit. And uh, I have to say, I am absolutely shocked at how well the 600 runs. I mean, I, I was, I didn't know what to think, but I, kind of in the back of my head, I thought, you know, I might be a little underwhelmed. And uh, no, not at all. This thing is fantastic. I'm trying to keep as much water off of it as possible. And she light up the back wheel just as easy this one well I'll talk about this here in a minute but uh there's not a sport mode for it so just then the uh it realized I was taking a turn and it and that uh the nanny kicked in a little bit but lacking power heck no 600 parallel twin and this thing just snorts right along and I like it it seems torquier, I don't, you know, and kind of that single cylinder, twin cylinder kind of a feeling. It just doesn't have uh, quite a rush at the top that the 900 does. But that's probably quarter throttle. This thing's new. I can't, I can't flog it. As much as I'd love to, I can't do it. Like I always say, would you want this to be your motorcycle and watch some knucklehead doing a video on it and beating on it? Uh, I think not. All right. That's incredible. <laughs> that is so cool. I don't know what the weight difference is between the 600 and the 900, but I, it's got to be lighter. I mean, the motor physically is is considerably smaller listen to that lovely twin exhaust note boop, 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 boop. motor's nice and quiet it's absolutely we don't have the panels on it i think we might be out of the panels or they just haven't assigned one to it you can see the Cosmoly, you see the smoke coming off. That's the protective coating. Just in case something like this was to sit in a crate for a while, they put a like a Cosmoly type coating on things to for longevity. But $84.99 is, is full boat suggested retail. I'm thinking for $8,500 bucks, I could live with a 600 no problem not lacking anything is the 900 more exhilarating yeah <laughs> but still I would ride this thing with just a huge smile on my face non-stop so let's um uh, man it's funny you get these back roads and there's no traffic how they just retain the water forever it seems oh, that's not so bad And again, I'm just barely, barely on the throttle. I know because the CVT system, it has a different sound to it. But, uh, yeah, she's babying it. But in a straight line there, just like the 900, you blip the throttle and it... You know, she, she lights the rear wheel up real easy. But because it does, oh, I didn't talk about that. It doesn't have uh, the sport and eco modes like the 900s do. And uh, the rally, of course, has the rally mode, which is just go out free reign, pretty much. So uh, you know, when you go into that mode and you go to change it, it just, it doesn't go deeper into the mode. It just switches back to the, <laughs> to the dash when you push and hold to get into it. But that's fine. So if you're one that wants to go out and do uh, 
you know do some drifting and donuts and stuff like that the, the 600 is not going to let you do that but again the spiders don't so i'm used to it although the f3s f3s i think you can uh you can tune or you can kind of let it go free in a, in a certain mode all right here's a little kind of high, highway simulation here yeah, she gets right up to speed, no problem. Dude, this thing is just absolutely happy at almost 60. Oh, yeah, this thing just doesn't care. That's fan-freaking-tastic. Let's see if we can get it to drift a little bit. Nope. Nanny kicks in. She was... She was tail wagging a little bit, but I could feel the whoa, whoa, whoa. I could feel the nanny. That's, again, that's okay. You know, somebody like Kelly would probably be the one riding this thing 99% of the time. She would absolutely care less. Would not care. She's not going to go out there and do that kind of stuff. I can't believe that 600 twin pulls that well. I know on camera there's no way of almost like need like a G-force meter or something so you can see the pull. I mean, you feel it. You just have to ride one of these things to see what I'm talking about. It's just I love when something just has that torquey, booming pull to it. Not a horsepower because the horsepower is just a mathematical calculation. Torque is what you feel. That's what you that's what's really under under the hood. I don't know what the speed limit is here, so I probably shouldn't go across here at 35. I don't think there I know there's not a tab on the back of this. But anyway, thank you guys for uh, for coming for a quick little rip on the 600 Riker. I've had a lot of requests. When are you guys getting 600? When are you getting them? When are you getting them? I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> so it's funny, yesterday I asked when we're getting it, and they go, well, there's two of them down there right now. See that young kid? His eyes are about to bug out of his head. The young people just, like, love this thing. And then you got the, the goofballs at, you know, three wheels versus two. Dude, it's, it's a different ride, but no less fun. It's like a go-kart. It's like a three-wheeled go-kart. That's what these things feel like. They don't feel like the spiders. They're so much fun. But anyway, thank you guys very much for uh, coming along for the little rip. And uh, we'll talk to you on the next vlog. This time of year, it's going to be mostly review stuff, as you know how the winters go. Because <laughs> uh, it's never dry enough, long enough for me to do any ride stuff at home unless I get those days. But anyway, thanks again. You guys take care now. Thanks for watching.